Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today it is time for a haul. Mainly a Primark haul, but also a bit of boots, a bit of new look, a bit of Lakeland and stuff like that. So, let's get started. So first of all, I went to boots and my hair is dull and just looks rubbishy at the minute. I think I mentioned before that I'm allergic to some products in shampoos and conditioners, which really limits my um, choice of shampoos and conditioners that I can use so I've kind of got to use really bland basic ones which is not doing very much for my hair so I went into Boots yesterday and had a massive read of all the labels and read all the ingredients um, and this is something I can use so I'm going to try this it is the Rio 5 Give Me Moisture Treatment Mask which inten which gives intensive hydration and stunning softness with five vital oils and you get quite a bit and it's quite a big tub and you just I guess scoop your hand in it and put it on your hair I think this is one of those things it doesn't instruct you how often to use it but I think I'm gonna do it maybe every 10 days or like every third wash because I think things like this if you do it all the time they don't work as well so I got that and then also to go with that problem it looks like a yellow bottle this doesn't it but it's actually a white liquid anyway i got the i've heard some good reviews about this and this is the dove hair therapy nourishing oil care leave in conditioning and care spray it's weightless and it's for and nourishes for a smooth frizz free hair and basically you can use this on wet or dry hair it's got a sprayer topper sprayer topper and oh yeah i'm hoping that this does something good for my hair and nourishes it and give it some life back because it's looking poor at the minute so i've got that and then also i take these um I don't want to call them vitamins some food supplements that's what they are um because i don't eat much fish because i don't really like it and i don't really think fish fingers count for it so i have these natured aids everyday essentials complete efa 1200 milligrams or micrograms never know what the m stands for if you know what the m stands for let me know in the comments rich in omega-3 6 and 9 and essential fatty acids and you get 90 capsules and they are 12.99 so it works out about a pound a week um and they've got a load of all, all the ingredients there if you can read that and it's in focus you can pause this video but it, it tells you loads of all the things that you get and stuff and they are a good supplement because I don't eat any fish really. So I've got them. Now i got, can you guess what this is? So ever since I got it for Christmas, I have just f become addicted to Hershey's chocolate bars. So I got the cookies and cream white chocolate ones times two for 99p for one. So that was a good buy. Oh God. And that's basically, I've been waiting. I wanted to eat these yesterday, but I wanted to film the video with them like intact. So as soon as this video finishes, I'm eating some of these. And if you've not seen what it looks like, I'll show you. Ooh, that's good. I didn't realize it had that sticker on the back. I'll show you. Basically an excuse for me to eat it, but that's what it looks on the front. So it's got Hershey's written on the front. And then like, you can see all the like chocolate chips in it. And now, I'm having some. Mm. Oh, you need some of this in your life. I can't even tell you. Go buy some. It's amazing. You can get it from Asda, I think, because Asda and Walmart are some sort of partners or something now, aren't they? And obviously, Walmart's American. Asda are stocking these babies up. So go buy some. Go do it. Go do it. And then I went into New Look and saw this pretty little red flower. I think it's from the 915 range and it was 2 and I thought this might look nice. You know, if you have like a, a bun at the top of your head and then you put that over the bun, I thought the little flowers around it look nice and pretty. So they're nice little red flowers. I got them and then I went into Lakeland and I got this cool contraption. It looks like this. And right, pause this video and write in the comments what you think it is. Right. What it is, is it is a tea bag thingy here. I don't know what to call it. But what you do is you pull the end up like that. So your grabber opens. So you place your tea bag in this bit and then you close it. And then when your tea bag's in there, you put it in your cup and you leave it like to stew or you move it around or whatever. And then when it's like your stewing time's up, you push the top down 
and that plunger comes and it like drains your tea bag off in your cup and then you release that you go to the dustbin and go and it drops out so you don't need to use a spoon and um you don't burn your hands and it's no mess that's what the packaging claims anyway so i got this little gadget from lakeland and i love little gadgets like this and i'm excited to use it even though i don't drink tea but looks good and that was like five pound i think and it can go in the dishwasher as well which is good oh and i see there on the side it's called a tea tool so that is good and then also from Lakeland, I don't have it on me at the minute, but we needed a new apron in our household and Mary Berry, Mary Berry has got her range in Lakeland. So we've got a blue Mary Berry apron, which looks so nice. It's so sturdy and it's thick and it's got a nice big pocket on it and bloody bloody blah, all the care instructions. But yeah, I've got a little Mary Berry apron, so that's nice. And then also, you might recognise this from Zoella's haul on, was it Sunday she put it up? And I thought I need one of those too. So I went to Lakeland and bought a 500 milliliters milk bottle. And it says it's for milk, smoothies, shakes, juices, cocktails, and much more. And it's dishwasher safe, which is good. So basically, it's a milk bottle with a nice silver cap. And you can have drinks. And I thought it looks cute. It looks nice. I want a little straw in it. And it'll look cool. And I thought it'll be nice to have drinks in in the summer, put it in the fridge. And also because it's glass, it can be re-washed, re-washed, re-washed and it won't go all yucky. And sometimes, you know, when you reuse plastic all the time, the bottles stink. If you've got an old water bottle that you've had for ages, go smell it. Obviously, when this video finishes and you'll just smell all the grossness. Glass doesn't do that. So I got this and I can't wait to drink out of it and make it look nice. And also, I think it might encourage me to drink more if it's, you know in a nice glass bottle so I got that and then these were on offer and they look so much fun these are the treat Wilton treat pops um push pop container thingies so I've not opened them yet but you get six and they are the push pop containers so you've got the plunger and the nice little lid and if you can see that's kind of what you make so you can have it standing up you can have a little thingy on the top and you can make this with fruit with cakes with biscuits basically anything you want and they was down i think from eight pounds to three pounds so i thought i had to have them so i can't wait to use them and make some exciting things if you want me to film me making things with them give this video a thumbs up or let me know in the comments and i will get on to doing that for you right next up is probably the bit you've been waiting for it's the primark goodies so first of all I just needed some new nail files. And tell you what, Primark, I've got so many, like, beauty things and knickknacks now. It's, it's really good, actually, and they're all really reasonably priced. So I got these nail files, which are a pound. I just got a flower one, a little owl one, and a pink one. Basically, I needed some. And I bought some. And I got these really cute little, they call them shoe liners. I always call these ankle socks. But you get, I love, like, the pastel kind of shade. So you get a pink one a blue one and a white one and I got the cute little frills and I thought like in the summer if you're wearing like a skirt or some shorts or something and you got little pumps on these will look really cute just poking out at the top of the pumps and they were two quid and I like them and then from Primark I got this red cardi I've been wanting a Primark red cardi for ages so it's just one of their like basic ones at six pounds they never come on a hanger these cardies that's why I look how creased it is I'm gonna have to iron this before I use it and it's got the little golden ooh, golden dot not dots what they call buttons all down the front and a little golden trim around the neckline and then it's just plain red on my back so i got that which i've been wanting a while because i think red suits me quite well and when you wear a white t-shirt i think it pairs really nicely so i got that then this doesn't look very good on the hanger but i got this like sheer dotty top so you like wear like a little vest top underneath it it's got a nice pretty bow on it and it's like the navy and the white dots and this was six pounds and it's slightly longer on at the back than it is at the front and on the back it's just got the little ruffly thing i don't even know what to call these i'm not very good at describing things and the nice little ruffly shoulder bits so i got that and i think that's really pretty if you can see a bit closer there there's the dots there's a nice bow so i got that one 
Oh, it's moving on its own. <laughs> right, and then I got this, which is a, um, I don't know if it's black or navy blue, who knows, one of the two colours, on white stripy jumper with a built-in collar. You don't have to have a t-shirt on underneath it or a collar. It's a built-in collar. We love the built-in collars. So this comes, basically, as I just said, with a built-in collar and it's got a little button on the back to do it with and a little, um, so the collie's keyhole thing is, that's what I'm going to call it. So it's a nice, feels like a nice knit actually and it's not like the wool that's going to itch you and it's not overly thick either which is good and it's just got the cute little like lacy collar which I think is pretty so I got that now I've never had one at Primax five pound dresses before but that's changed because I've got one and look wow five pounds so I got one of the Primark five pound dresses so basically this is a greeny colour with white flowers all over it and they come with nice three quarter sleeves and they've got like a little kind of skittery kind of skirt bottom bit They're not too long they just come above your knee and there's no clinching or anything it's just a nice plain dress but it fits really nicely and that's what it looks like I'm sure a loads of you have had the Primark five pound dresses before but I never have and I really liked it when I tried it on so I got that which I think will be nice for summer because I think little dresses are going to be pretty big this like spring and summer and stuff so that's pretty I like it I saw a top like this in New Look the other day which was a pink one and I almost got it and it was £14 I think but I don't know I liked it but it didn't look quite right on me so I didn't get it and then I went into Primark and saw this for a fiver and I like it much more. It's like one of the sporty, basketball -y type tops. So it's got Michigan Dream number 15 on it. And it's navy blue and it's got your stripes at the top. Your stripes at the bottom. And it looks like that. And on the back it's just completely plain apart from like the stripes on your arm. But there's none at the bottom. And I love that and I've wanted one of these for ages. So, got that. I have been wanting one of these tops for so long but I've not been able to bring myself to buy ones from ASOS because I feel like they're too expensive. Anyway this was £4 and they had it in so many different combinations. They had it in blue with white sleeves, red with pink sleeve, the white with the grey and another one but I forget what that was now. But basically it's just one of these tops that is white in the middle and has then got a different colour sleeves. And I blooming love it and I've wanted one of these for ages and it's a long sleeve one so it'd be good for the winter. And I got one at last, yay! Oh hey, it's Daffy Duck. That was a poor voice. But anyway, I got some pyjamas, I fancied some new ones and I tried these really nice giraffe ones on. But, I don't know, these ones just looked a bit better so I got these ones. These were £10 for the top and the bottoms. So the top is a nice pink with, is it Daffy Duck? I think it is because she's got a bow on so it's not Donald. So it's got her on the front in a nice pink and short sleeves. And then the bottoms are these nice blue and white check ones and the long. And they have just got a little bow on the front that you can tie it. And that's that. That's all there is to say about them really. So that, my lovely viewers, is my Primark haul. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you've bought anything lately, leave me a link to your video or channel or your pictures on your Instagram or Twitter. And I will be sure to go have a look at them. Um, I hope you enjoyed it then. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And subscribe to my channel to see new videos. I'm trying to put videos out every Tuesday about 7pm UK time. Um, but if not every Tuesday every other Tuesday. You know how it goes sometimes. Sometimes life gets in the way and you can't always put a video up. So I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. Goodbye!